Team Exclusive and welcome back to another episode of the Draft 2 Glory. So today is a, is a new day, it's a new draft day. If you've seen the first episode that was posted uh, either yesterday or a couple of days ago, whenever this goes up, uh, you will know how this kind of goes. If you don't, you uh, can see the wheel behind me, someone's on one of these screens. Um, and that will choose what kind of draft we're going to make. So let's jump over to this, you can actually see it in full view. We've got the likes of Icon Draft, Prem Draft, La Liga Draft, Fastest Draft, that kind of stuff. So there's all different types of, you know, uh, league themes, player orientated kind of themes, like no Icon Draft as well. Um, so it should be, it should be quite interesting to see what we're going to get today. I was debating whether or not to do like one themed draft a week and then one kind of like, you know, not themed draft so I can just kind of build what I want. But um, we'll go with this for now and then we'll kind of work out those rules a bit later on. So um, the first spin, give it a spin. What's it going to be? Is it going to be kind to us or is it going to be harsh? We're going to get a no icon draft. Okay. Ironically, this could be quite good because um, last time when we built the draft, we didn't get any icons at all. So uh, if, you know, if we don't get any icons, I can, I can kind of just build what I want, but obviously we can't take any icons regardless. So um, it is what it is, isn't it? That's what the uh, that's what the wheel has chosen. So that is what we will be doing. Uh, if we quickly jump over to the draft and we'll get this underway. Um, yeah, so last draft, we built 182, uh, which I'm looking to improve upon. Um, and obviously we built a league undraft, so it wasn't, wasn't the greatest draft in the world. But it wasn't uh, wasn't the worst either. Do you get a four four two holding, which could be alright. Uh, or we've got. I don't want to go with the same formation. I don't want to go with a three back either. Or a four three three. Um, let's go with. I've heard quite good things about the four four two, but uh, you know what? Let's let's change it up. Let's go with the four four two. We use the four three three quite a lot on our road to glory. And the first player we're going to get is Shevchenko. Wow. Wow. I mean, ironically, I probably would take Cristiano anyway. So I think that's probably a good option. But not terrible. Okay, we're not missing out too much on that icon. Just hopefully we don't get another one in this pick. Um, we don't. We do get Muriel, though, which could be quite a good link, actually, to um, Cristiano. Uh, left mid is going to give us Perisic. We got, or we got Carrasco... Grealish, Grzycki. He looks quite good, to be fair, uh, in the prime, obviously, isn't he? Yeah, but we, uh, I think it's probably smart that you'd probably agree to take Perisic, right mid. I don't know who we could really get. Uh, Hikimi, that's not a bad shout. Not the best shooting, um, but nobody else there really looks that good either. So we'll take Hikimi um, for right mid. So far, it's been quite a good... Basic bitch Syria squad. Um, Kimmich. Hmm. Do we take Kimmich or do we, do we take the safe option of going for Vecino? I don't know how you pronounce that, but uh, we could take Andre French. I'm going to take Kimmich. I'm going to I'm going to risk it for a biscuit, and hopefully we get somebody else from Bayern Munich or Bundesliga. Do you get Brozovic? It's not a bad shout, actually. I, hmm. Or Darun. Brozovic or Darun or Delaney. So Delaney obviously would get a link to Kimmich. Obviously then just getting uh, soft links all around the team otherwise. Um, or do we take... So he would get a strong link to Muriel. Or we could take Brozovic for a strong link to Perisic. Choices. Uh, actually, he would get a perfect link, wouldn't he? So he'd get a perfect link. That probably is the smart option. I don't know, really. Um, let me know who you'd probably choose in the comment section below. But I'm going to choose... I'm going to choose Delaney, because I think he looks better than everybody else. Uh, it may be unsmart, but, you know, hoping we get some more Serie A players in the future picks. That could come back quite nicely on us. I will take Dagba. Doesn't uh, link to anybody, nor will he probably be in the squad at the end of it. Um, we do get Alexandro. Alexandro. Schulz. So we have got kind of a Bundesliga theme going on right now, and he would be slightly better 
I say better, but faster. We'll, we'll, we'll go safe and go Alexandro, because I think um, I think he's probably the better choice. Scriniar, that's not a bad shout. Or Manalas. Scriniar, do we take the faster option in Manalas, or do we take maybe a slightly better option in Scriniar? Um, how tall is... So he's 6'2", low high. Then we've got medium high, 6'2", Scriniar. Um, we'll take... We'll take Manalas. I don't know if that was a good option. Go for goalkeeper. It's going to give us Strakosha. It's the only Serie A, so we'll take it. You know, getting all that chem. And then we get De Vry as well. Yeah, nobody else links. Uh, kind of regret taking that Bundesliga midfield now, but it, it is what it is. Uh, of course, we'll take uh, De Vry. So at the moment, we've actually got a very basic Serie A squad with Cristiano Ronaldo up top. Nothing really too exciting. Um, everybody's on basic chemistry, so it's not too terrible. Get Corona. Um, we get Kalahal Noglu. Sischenko Upamecano. He is Bundesliga in French. Uh, hmm. I guess we can take Upamecano. He's probably the best option out of all of those choices. Um... Reserve pick number two is going to give us nobody else to take Bamford. It doesn't matter. No one's going to make it onto the team or the bench. Adama Traore has got to be. Big Adama. Cannot deny him. Harry Kane, rule breaker. Neymar. Mares, Sterling. Hmm. Choices. Okay, so we have Alexandro. Alexandro, who could link to Neymar. Hmm. It's got to be the option, hasn't it? It's got to be the option, Neymar. Kane, super sub. Oh. Kane as a super sub. Or Neymar as a super sub either way would be quite good as well. We'll take Neymar. He links to links to Alexandro. And uh, we could also do him as a super sub. We get big man Mo Salah and rule breaker Di Maria. Um, Draxler as well. Mm. We could build quite an interesting team actually now. So we've got Open Meccano. got Draxler linked to Neymar. He would then link to, uh, um, what's his face, uh, Kimmich in the mid. Is that what we go for? I mean, everybody else would be a super sub otherwise. But Salah, hmm. I don't know, he'd be off chem as well. So I'm just going to go for Mo Salah, doesn't matter. Really, it doesn't matter at this point. Um, so, go with goalkeeper bench it may have been the wrong choice taking Mo Salah but I think having a, a really good impactful super sub could or would be more beneficial than taking Drax who would be off chem wildly do you get one Bernat who actually is quite good um, for the team actually he's good for chemistry so we'll take him don't think there was any Bundesliga players or Serie A players in there anyway get Klosterman oh yo this team is shaping up to be quite a Bundesliga team now get Klosterman we don't have a goalkeeper for him, unfortunately, but we could do something like Klosterman. I could do... Oh, he wouldn't work, would he, for chemistry, but let's try and put these players in, just see what it looks like anyway. Get Neymar. Yes, yeah, so not, not brilliant stuff. Alexandro there, of course, then we could do... Can I go back to our Serie A roots? Probably would be more chemistry. Hmm. Okay, so we've got a few options. We've got a few options to kind of play around with. Um, I mean, if we got another goalkeeper, those those two could work quite well, but we didn't get a Bundesliga goalkeeper. So we get a bit shafted, really. Nobody to help us. So we'll take Nicolas Pepe, because he's Arsenal. Why not? Kai Havertz. Ooh. Okay, Kai Havertz, Bellarabi, Lorente. Who do we have? We've got Hikimi. Um, Bellarabi wouldn't really help at all. I mean, it'd get chemistry, but it would take chemistry away from Cristiano Ronaldo. It's a bit of a mess, this team. It's not brilliant, to be fair. We haven't got that many brilliant picks. But we'll take... Where does he play? He plays in the Saudi League. That's incredible. Um, We shall take... Kai Havertz. Why not? He looks all right, to be fair. Bale, Kylian Mbappe. Oh, yo. We've got to do it. We've got to take Kylian Mbappe, surely. 
Bale, Real Madrid is quite nice, but Kylian Mbappe for the link to link to Neymar. Look at that team. Ronaldo, Neymar, Mbappe. Can't say no to that. If we got like a strong link to Cristiano, I don't know who that would be. Anybody. Ericsson. He wouldn't be he, he doesn't actually help at all. Doesn't really help us at all. Uh because he would be off chem any anyway. Jesus. See, so now it's Carvajal. Do I take him for a uh, slightly better right back? Because it's going to be off chemistry anyway. We just haven't got the picks. Just haven't got the picks that we really wanted. So, I don't know. We'll take Carvajal. We'll take him and put him in. He's probably better than... Well, he is better than Dagbar on four chemistry anyway. Um, bigger Dharma. What's it? Oh, okay. Who do we actually need? Who would who would give us chemistry? Who would give... Uh, it's not going to be great either way, is it? It's going to be pretty poor. We'd give Kimmich five. Yeah, not not the best draft in the world, to be fair. This is not uh, not gone terribly amazing. Um, we'll take... We could get Neymar on ten. Doesn't really help. I, him on five might be quite good, because four is... Four's acceptable. Five is slightly better, so it's really just who I want. We'll, we'll do we'll do Kimmich. I think it might be better. So actually, considering we've got no icons, we actually built a really poor draft in the end of it. Um, yeah, not not amazing. Just really kind of dead low end picks. There wasn't really much I could I could do. Um, maybe I picked wrong. Maybe I did. I really don't know. But it might be. I'm just gonna have a quick look, see what it's look, see what it looks like with more of a Syria focused team. So let's put him in. What kind of chemistry are we actually looking at? Would he give more chemistry? Would and I could put Upi Moncano there. So, hmm, that's not a bad team to be fair. Um, I don't know who I prefer in the actual starting squad, though. Do we go with something like that? I mean, Delaney's wildly off chemistry there, but we could... Who could we play there? Banat, maybe. He is on four, so I don't think he loses stats, does he? He doesn't. He gets his base stats, which isn't terrible. We get Kimmich on eight. If Meccano's on six, so he gets a bit of a boost. Bappe's on seven with a shadow. Not that he needs any pace boost. Uh, Cristiano on a seven as well, so he gets a bit of a bit of a boost in certain areas. And then Neymar's on ten basically, and the rest is on the rest. Okay, that's not a bad that's not a bad team actually. To be fair, looking at it now, the only player I'd really change would be Delaney. And uh, unfortunately, we just didn't get a midfielder from. Um, from Ligue 1, that you know, like a CDM, CM kind of player that we could actually play there. Never got one. Um, so that was the best we, we got. But he is on four chemistry, so I think that's not terrible. It's not a terrible draft. Of course, if I have missed anything, uh, you know, do let me know in the comment section below. That would be very much appreciated. And if you are enjoying this episode or enjoying the series so far, please do drop it a like. That would be greatly appreciated as well. Um, but with that said, let's jump into the first game. See how things go. See if we can uh, pick up another first round win. Or we're just going to take the L. Alright, that was very quick. So, first game today. Um, yeah, the draft could definitely have gone better. But then again, looking at this guy's draft, it uh, wasn't the greatest pick either. He does have quite a few good centre-backs in... Is that Upper Moncano? I don't know who that... Di that dynamic, dynamic image looks really off. But he does have a, a par and an icon I saw in there. Good two so, I think it was. Um, good looking team regardless. But we do have some very good players as well. Mbappe, Neymar, that kind of stuff. I think we're going to get a first round uh, quit anyway. Not sure exactly why, but we will take it. Uh, we'll take it. Credit to him, actually, for scoring for scoring an own goal. You know, a lot of people wouldn't do that. They'd probably just quit. So, you know, big props, big props. Anyway, that was the first round done. So, uh... Uh, I shall take it. We got a one 0 win. Rage quit. Well, I didn't rage quit. Um, he just quit. Whatever reason. Uh, and we're moving on to the second round. Anyway, so on to the second round. Uh, this is equaling our 
best finish as of yet. And we come up against another very, very good team. It's got uh, Jesus, who's, who's always a danger. He's got Neymar, Messi, De Jong, Longley, Laporte, Kamara, I think that was the left back, the rule breaker. Very, very good looking team. Um, you know, we have kind of been gifted gifted this um, second round entry. Oh. So I'm hoping, you know, we can uh, we can not, uh, not bottle it, which would be nice. Oh my God, already, really? Oh my days. Jesus Christ. Can't believe that. The goalkeeper just crumbled like a like a piece of paper absolutely crumb okay still got it pass to Mbappe off to Neymar he's in through to Mbappe oh my god what was that Mbappe ah oh, no way man he's right there as well and he just can't pick it up that's a goal yeah goalkeeper not even fucking doing anything he's just standing there asking him to come out and get the ball He's just not going to do it. Got Neymar using that pace. Skip past him. Pass it off. Mbappe. Oh my god. I can't score with Mbappe. What is actually happening? Mbappe. Go on. Please, Mbappe. No, oh my god. That was so bad. I genuinely don't know what's going on. I Either I'm terrible, which is probably like the outcome, but like... All these chances with Neymar, uh, Mbappe rather. Go on, Hakimi, you've got the pace to get past. Put a cross in, come on, somebody. Nope. Go on, Ronaldo. Mbappe, yes, there we go. Mbappe gets the first goal, some nice work from Cristiano on the edge to uh, to finally get it across him and finally scored you know this guy is pretty good but I, he has got like weaknesses in his game we're just trying to exploit them a little bit and hopefully just not concede uh, more than he can score so that's really the aim right about now oh Mbappe's through come on Mbappe oh my god really I need to do a finesse it. I need to have finessed it, but come on. Cristiano, somebody get your head on that. If Mancano did, but... Neymar! Damn. Seeing Mbappe. Okay. I, I wanted to do a fake shot, but uh, he said no, apparently. Oh, that's not good. That's a goal. Oh my god, what a save by Strakosha. Holy. I think he was offside, but that was one hell of a save, regardless. Okay, all right. First half done. We're only uh, we're only one goal down, which isn't terrible. It is not terrible. We're really fighting for that second goal. We should have got it. We should have got it by now. But just poor chances and poor shooting choices by myself led to uh, Mbappe just not scoring. I've had good, you know, plenty of chances to actually get in this game and win it potentially. Mbappe's through. Come on, please finish it. Mbappe, let's go. Puts it in the back of the net finally with a great shot. 2-2, two, two, let's go. Just try and not bottle job it now so we can actually potentially win this game. Delaney working the midfield. Let's go. Cristiano. Cristiano. Ronaldo, let's go. 3-2. Holy... Yo, I, I've got to be honest, I thought when we were 2-0 down, I thought we were completely out. Might still be out, but we've picked up the lead for now. This is so good. Oh, I tackled that. I tackled that. Come on! I made the tackle. It's just these stupid-ass bounces running on through. Oh, I saw that run. going to get there as well. But Damn. All right, let's make some subs. We're going to have to take off a few people. Um... Not Ronaldo, we're going to take off Hakimi or Salah. Hmm. Don't really have that many options, to be fair. We're going to take off. This is defending like 94. We're going to bring. Let's actually bring on Adama. 
at right back. I think he'll be all right. And that will be uh, Delaney for Havertz. Okay, going a little bit more attacking. Kind of what we need right now. Just a bit more pace. A bit more attacking in the midfield. So, I'm not sure where that's going. But okay, Mbappe. Nope. That's sad. That's so sad. That's so sad how that's just slipped on through past my uh, goalkeeper. Mbappe, okay, Neymar. Are you kidding me? Are you actually joking me? Really? Frustrating. Frustrating stuff. Frustrating. Uh, it's just unreal. Every single time, second round, opponent just seems to be, oh, I'm so pissed. I'm so annoyed. It's so annoyed. We had such a good chance and then just, just crumbled it, crumbled it. But we had so many chances. To be fair, there's nobody, you know, that I can really blame but, but myself for, for missing those chances, you know. Had Mbappe in plenty of opportunities to bring it way in the lead, possibly 5-3 or whatever. Um... Just didn't take them. Just didn't didn't take them. So I can't be annoyed at anybody but myself. But yeah, that guy was good. And it always seems to be the second round. Second round guy is always just incredible. Um, so I really don't know what to say. Unfortunately, there'll be a point when we get good at get good at the draft. Possibly, I hope. I don't know. But yeah, it was a bit probably a bit of a short draft because obviously we were gifted the first round victory, which is a bit of a shame. It is what it is. It is what it is, and the same reward as per. We obviously might might make coins back this time. Um, I'm not crying, actually. I've just got something in my eye. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, we might make coins. Last time, we probably lost about two, 3,000 coins after selling what we sold. And I sold a few other things in the club as well from the packs in that draft episode. So, um, yeah, we only lost about two, probably just over about two, two and a half thousand coins. It's not terrible. We'll see what we get in this episode. Got a few other packs in store because of um, the uh, they've added the Euro um, Champions League League SBC. So we've got a few packs from doing the higher end tiers of that and, and what I can of that anyway. Um, so not terrible catalyst might actually sell. Nope, nothing really too sellable in this one. So we'll just put it all in the club for now. I'm not too worried about making coins. We do have like 230 odd, 215. Well now 1,000 uh, coins. So. Yeah, I'm not too worried about it. We don't get boards, though. Do get a rare player. Just going to be... Ooh, yo, Madison. Not wait, not Madison. I meant uh, a Drissa. He's actually going to sell for about probably 2.5, 2.3 maybe, 2,000. Wow, okay. Not quite as much, but he's going to sell for about... Let's put him up for 1,700,000 coins. Um... He's not going to sell for anything either, so that's okay. That's not terrible, to be fair. And we get a CDM to CM as well, which is going to sell for... I just noticed that. Uh, 2.8, 2.9, probably about 2.5. So we'll stick it up for 2.500 coins. We'll do something like that. That's fine. See how those go. So, yeah, if we manage to pick up a blue card, any blue rare would probably be quite expensive, especially if it's, um, I think, Porto ones like uh, Pepe and that kind of stuff, are quite expensive. So, you know, there's a chance we still could make some good coins with that new League SBC coming out. Don't get boards. Uh, yeah, we could actually make some serious coins by getting blues, if we can pack some, which we can't. Uh, which we can't. Nice. Uh, so, a bit of a shame, really. Paris Saint-Germain crowd chant might go for a bit as well. We'll sell that up, put him up as well. Um... I imagine, yeah, 200 engine might sell for a little bit, but it's not really worth it, to be fair. Keep hold of those. Um, so, not terrible stuff, to be fair. We probably have lost quite a few coins on this episode, understandably. But, um, yeah, so let's uh, let's work through these packs. So these were obviously from part of the uh, Champions League SBC, League SBC thing. We get a walkout. Let's go. Who's it going to be? 
Poland. Striker is Lewandowski. Let's go. What a pull. 91 rated Lewandowski. Yo, that's sick. Highest rated card we pulled on the road to glory. What are you saying? What are you saying? I don't know if he's actually expensive. I don't know if he's expensive, but we'll take that. Yo, that's a big pull. Big, 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 big. That's 70 odd thousand coins. That's pretty good. I mean, that's what, if he goes for 75, he's not, he's going to for about 70 or just under. That's catered for about 30, 45, 65. If my math, math is correct, about five drafts. That's pretty cool. So, yo, we'll stick him up. That's massive. Lewandowski. And then we get an MLS silver as well. He might be, he might go for a little bit as well. Um, that's really good. That's really sick. MLS players might sell for quite a bit. And then get Dutch. He's not going to sell for anything either. Any kind of pace he might possibly. Maybe. Might sell for a little bit. And then Maranga. Uh, just get rid of him. Get rid of him. And get rid of him. That's fine. I'm not really too worried about those. Um, yeah, so that's made all our coins. But we don't have to worry about making profit now, to be fair. Out of the, out of just packing Lewandowski, that's sick. Of course, it could still have been uh, Chesney, which I was really expecting it to be. But, yo, that's that's big. Real big. No walkout in this one. No boards, sadly. No boards. Can we get a blue, though? Blue would give us quite a few coins. Nope. But anyway, that'll do it for today's episode. Hopefully you have enjoyed. Hopefully you enjoyed that massive pull at the end. Um, some serious coinage we've made. Not not the most coinage I think you could have made if it was somebody like Mbappe or Griezmann or whatever. You know, obviously it would have been rolling in coins. But uh, 70,000 coins or thereabouts isn't bad regardless. Um, so mm -hmm. definitely, definitely take that. Of course, if you did enjoy this video, please do drop it a like. That would be very much appreciated. Uh, of course, we'll help the channel out and help it grow. Uh, if you do enjoy the channel, do, do enjoy what we do here, please do hit that subscribe button. And of course, become part of this exclusive family. Um, but with that said, I do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.